Hey guys, welcome to another lesson here at THSS Technology. Uh, today we're going to continue on doing some work in RPG Maker. Uh, we're going to learn how to make our very first event. Excellent, so let's get started. So last time, uh, last couple lessons, we went over designing some very simple maps. Uh, we made a field map here, and we made a exterior map using the exterior tile set here. But kind of the big problem here is, well, we have a collection of maps now, but it's still not a game. So let's uh, let's explore into event mode and uh, actually make our game do something. So uh, over here on the world map, you can see my little character there floating in the middle of the ocean. That's actually the first thing we're going to fix. But in order to do that, we need to change modes. So up here at the top, here on the top menu bar, there is a mode dropdown. And as you can see, we have map mode, event mode, and region mode. You can see the corresponding hotkeys, and you can also see the similar buttons up here. So I'm going to switch it over to event mode now, and I'm going to get this grid all over my screen. And actually, while we're in event mode, we actually can't paint any more tiles. You can only paint tiles when you're in map mode. Okay, as you can see from there. So let's go back to event mode here, and let's change our player's starting position. So currently, my starting position is in the middle of the ocean by this little whirlpool. Uh, I'm not liking that. So in order to change your character's starting position, click on the tile where you'd like them to, to be, where you want the event to be. We're going to right click and we're going to set starting position for the player right there. Okay, excellent. So now if we actually go and play our game, let's just go uh, save it here. And I can walk around my game using the arrow keys, the WSD keys, but when I step on this town, it doesn't take me into it. And that's because this is just a picture of a town. It has no idea. Uh, to take me over to here. So let's make that happen now. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to click on the town where I want the transfer to be. I'm going to right click and it's going to bring up this menu again. Now new event, we're going to go into that in another lesson, uh, but we actually just want quick events. RPG Maker has a couple stock quick events uh, to make your job a little easier and we want the very first one, transfer. So when we click transfer, this transfer window is going to pop up and it's going to ask us to set our destination. So I'm going to click the dot, 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 I'll zoom in here and go to my town one because this is where I want my destination to be. And then you need to actually click in the map where you want to enter. So I'm going to enter right there. Okay. I'm going to click OK. I'm going to click OK. And now let's go up and test our game again. Okay, I can walk around and now when I walk on this map tile, it's going to take me up into Goodmanville. Excellent. But uh-oh, we can't leave. So let's fix that now. So now I'm going to go into Goodmanville here and I'm going to want my exit point here. And uh, the way that I designed the map with this fence around it, it gives the players a very clear uh, um, idea of where they need to exit. And that's an important part of map design is let the maps kind of guide your character. It'll make it a lot easier and less confusing for the player. So I want to exit right there. So I'm going to click there. I'm going to right click. Quick event creation, transfer. I'm going to click the dot, dot, dot. And I want to transfer out to map one. And we'll go right to there. Click OK. We'll click OK. Let's go test now. It's always good to test your events whenever you're putting them in. So I can walk into the town and I can walk out of the town, but I should be able to walk into my town there. That's intuitive. So let's go back to our map once again, click there, right click, quick event, transfer, set the destination. Destination's right there, okay, okay. And one final test, and I think we will be good to go. Perfect, go in, go out. Let's see if I can go into this side, and still go out, excellent. All right, hope you enjoyed that lesson, and we will see you later.